let me start this off by first and foremost saying our president I don't hate him Morning squad, I'm feeling amazing today. I'm appreciating it a lot, I'm very grateful. Take a moment right now and be appreciative of the fact that you are breathing, you are looking at this video right now. These are things we take for granted and we should. Today is cardio and stretching day only. I'm not touching any weights today. Leave the video a thumbs up, this is gonna be a good one. A full day of eating video. You guys always ask me for full day of eating videos. I don't know why, because it's not a lot of information. I only eat twice a day and I eat the same stuff that I eat in every video, but I'm gonna do it today. I'm gonna track the macros on the screen so you can see exactly what I'm eating. Um, right now I'm eating about 2,400 calories. Uh, I'm on a cut. I've upped my, my calorie intake because I noticed that my energy levels were dipping. I noticed that my body fat was dropping a little bit too fast. So I'm trying to pace this a little bit more. Biggest thing I noticed is my, my, my mood. My mood changed significantly, so yeah, I, I up my calories a little bit. And pay attention to this stuff, guys. I tell you guys all the time, this is like a science experiment. Look at, uh, pay attention to how your body responds. Like, like I mentioned, your sleep, your mood, your energy level, all these things are very important. Time to hit the gym. I'm on my way to the gym, and look, I know it could be hard as hell to get to the gym when it's 20 something degrees outside in these winter months, but let me tell you, if you push yourself through these months in the spring and the summer, you will flourish. You will flourish. Everybody will be looking at you like, man, he put in that work or she put in that work over the winter, so do it. So after my cardio session, I did 12 minutes of stretching. I didn't record it, but to be honest, I usually just YouTube some stretching routines and follow along. You could do the same thing. Now I'm about to jump in the sauna for 15 minutes. I do this at least four times a week. And then it's time to record the Get Well, Get Money podcast. If you want to take the guesswork out of eating healthy and support the channel at the same time, head over to bricksfitness.com, grab your custom meal plan. I make them all day. I just got home from the gym. The only thing I hate about the sauna is I sweat probably for the next three hours after the sauna. I'm setting up to record the podcast at home because they're doing some very aggressive construction at the office and the noise is unbearable. So if you haven't subscribed to the Get Well Get Money podcast, the link is in the description. Welcome to the Get Well Get Money podcast. You I'm your me? host, Clay McKamey Kyle Glover. <laughs> <laughs> I'm your host, Cook and Kimmy, in here, whipping it up, and nay nay in that up. So I guess this would be included in my full day eating. I am going to drink some coffee. This is our Nespresso machine. We got this drink. Black Friday for the low ski. Now let me share something with y'all. And this may be this may be TMI, so if you're one of them sensitive people about stuff. Go ahead, fast forward. I don't always drink coffee. I don't drink coffee every single day. I probably drink coffee three days a week. What up, squad? Welcome back to the podcast. I'm feeling amazing this morning. And before we started recording, yo, so it's very rare that I get excited about music because honestly, most of these new artists nowadays, they're trash. But I'm super excited about this new artist, Boogie, that Eminem recently signed. He just dropped the album. It's called Everything's For Sale. Go check that joint out. I'm really just endorsing it because I genuinely enjoy this music. I'm an artist myself. I don't rap anymore. Matter of fact, I may. I may get back in the booth soon. Stay tuned for that. Comment below if you heard of Boogie. Make sure you guys leave this video a big thumbs up. I need you. Good morning. This is Maria. She's my masseuse. Hi. Really quick, why is it important for people to get regular sports massages? Our regular sports massages help with overall uh, muscle flexibility, help mm -hmm. with um, just maintaining your um, mobility, help your muscles recover faster, and basically prevent injuries. 
and she's the best in the game. All her information will be in the description. If you are in the 757 area, you won't find a better masseuse, so come check her out. Amazing. First meal of the day, my go-to, which which the cop salad wrap. This thing right here is really good. So I'm meeting with my boy Jared for lunch. Here's what I do, right? This is how I'm strategic with this. I make sure I've met him at a place where I can not just eat healthy, but it's something that I can actually track. So I'm gonna put the macros for this the sandwich, and I've done it on the vlog before. I'm gonna put the macros for the sandwich on the screen right here. Here's the macros, and that's all it's about. I'm, I'm gonna have my chips. Yes, I'm gonna have my chips because you can have chips if you fit your macros. So yeah. Let me start this off by first and foremost saying that I am in no way affiliated with any type of political agenda. I don't really deal with politics at all i hate politics i don't trust politicians i don't trust media none of that and our president i don't hate him i don't love him i don't know the man but my spidey senses tells me that he's not a good person and and i don't care about politics and i know you guys care about politics a lot more and i'm not generalizing people care about politics and drama and all that crap way more than they care about their health so that's why I use this title. I figured I'd play off my name a little bit, right? My name is Bricks, and adopting a healthy lifestyle, it was kind of like building a wall, right? And I had to do it one brick at a time. And as I'm talking to you guys about this, I'm actually talking to myself because I tend to forget. I'm a very extreme person, and at times it's hard for me to be patient. But I remember that this lifestyle, this body was built one brick at a time and I can only lay one brick at a time I can't rush the process I can't do anything but lay one brick at a time and I can't I can't expect to build a wall the wall being this amazing body trying to rush it it can't happen that way you have to take your time you have to be patient and I you know what I apologize because I repeat this a lot but you know repetition is the king of, of learning and the more you're exposed to this message, the more you understand this, this theory. Look at this guy going ham. Bravo, come on. The more you hear it, the more it'll sink into your brain, and the more you'll respect process. Anything you do to try to speed up the process, in the long run, it's going to set you back. If your goal is to maintain your weight loss, if your goal is to adopt a healthy lifestyle, not just lose weight. Anybody can lose weight. Losing weight is easy, but keeping the weight off, reprogramming your, your, your habits, resetting your operating system, that's really what it takes in order to really make significant change in your life, in your body, long term. We want long term results. We don't want these short yo-yo, I lose 30 pounds and I gain 40 pounds. We don't want that. That's not worth nothing. That's actually very bad for your body. What you're doing is building a wall. And you have to do that one brick at a time, one day at a time, one decision at a time. And respect that. And I know I'm gonna get hate for this. I don't care though. Listen, my intentions are to help you guys. And I see way too many people trying to cram bricks into a wall and not doing it right. And that wall eventually crumbles. So this is my first snack of the day. It is rice cake with some peanut butter and some bananas. I actually had two, I already ate the first one. And a little bit of chocolate almond breeze. This definitely conquers my sweet tooth. Here are the macros. All right, squad, for dinner tonight, I am having this entire pizza. It is a cauliflower pizza. My wife doesn't feel like cooking. It's Friday, everybody's tired. And I'm also gonna have a pint of Halo, Halo Top. As you guys can see, I ate chips today. I ate ice cream. I ate rice cakes. And I'm still gonna lose body fat. 
And you're eating your veggies. <laughs> that doesn't count. They need to know that. Yeah. You I'm, don't go dinner without veggies. That's true. Tell I'm them. gonna I'm gonna eat veggies. It's very important to eat veggies for micro nutrients. Micronutrients. Tank. Yeah. Alyssa, yeah. take that bonnet off your head and come in the vlog. <laughs> My baby just got ex are those considered extensions? No. What is that? It's these. No, I'm talking about like the the the, the style of the hair. It's called No, it's called box braids. With, with fake hair, it's called extensions. Extensions is when you actually put it in, like when you sew it in. Oh, okay. Weave huh. is when you braid it in. Whatever, I don't know. End the vlog. I hope you got a great day today with this old man. Okay. Anyway, get well, get money.